You can see the Los Angeles is right there. Where is it? Right there. The second one down. That's crazy. It's not really time to go yet though. We still have like a half hour. So I'm not going to sit in a seat because that is incredibly dirty. I'm going to stand somewhere and wait. <laughs> Ticket for me, that little white slip. That means beyond Pittsburgh. Again, I've been driving to Pittsburgh. That means beyond that point of Pittsburgh, you're gonna be part of reboarding the bus. Alright, and you're gonna have your trip along the ways. When you get back on the bus, this will be a new driver. He or she will give you a different reboarding pass with a different number. You're gonna start to present your ticket and your reboarding pass so that driver can collect that reboarding pass and rescan your ticket. Again, I'm bringing a job as far as Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. You guys, we just made our first stop. Harrisburg, Pennsylvania. The bus is right there. It feels good to get some fresh air. It's only 1.48. Um, we left at 11.30, so we're like two hours deep. Um, this is a 45 minute stop. I don't think I'm gonna go anywhere. Cause I'm not hungry or anything like that. I'm just gonna sit down and stretch my legs. You guys, I'm so happy. I was so scared the bathrooms are gonna be dirty at this train station, but they're super clean. Look how clean it is in here. I'm so happy because I've been to some disgusting train station or bus station bathrooms. So look how clean it is. I'm so happy. I'm still gonna put stuff down and sanitize and wash everything I own and <laughs> everything on me but this is so clean I'm very happy you guys I love this hand sanitizer this hand sanitizer from Dr. Bronner it's a really good one you guys I made it to Pittsburgh I have an hour here they stopped the bus over there and they're gonna clean it desanitize it 
clean and empty the toilet, clean the bus, do everything, which I'm so happy about. I'm so happy they do that. That's new since the coronavirus because they didn't used to do that before. But yeah, so we have an hour layover here in Pittsburgh, which feels really nice to sit in a seat and not be on the bus. Um, I'm gonna walk around in a second and see if they have any actual food. Man, they have crap around here. Oh no, I'll show. I'll talk to you guys when I get food. Look what the bus driver did. He left these chocolates for me. Um, he's gone now. We have a new bus driver taking us to the next couple states. But look at these. He left. His name is Leo, and he left me chocolates. <laughs> no one's ever done this anything for me, so this is a big deal. Bye, Pittsburgh. You guys, we are, I think, 20 minutes away from Columbus, Ohio. We're not there yet, though. Soon. About 20 more minutes and we'll be in Columbus, Ohio. We just took a quick break because a lot of people wanted to smoke. So I'm, we're gonna wait like 20 minutes and then we're gonna get back on the bus and go to Columbus. I'm in Columbus, Ohio, and I just had the worst bathroom experience of my life. As soon as I get back on the bus, I'm getting my hand sanitizer, I'm getting my wipes. Oh my gosh, the bathroom was disgusting. Oh my gosh, I'm not liking Columbus, Ohio, <laughs> even though I'm only in the uh, Greyhound station, but it's just, ugh, disgusting. Mic on. I'm really tired. It is 11 o'clock. Um, and I got on the bus at 11.30, so I'm hitting the 12 hour mark. And I have to say, it's not that bad. It's really not. When I'm on the bus, I'm relaxed. Um, Leo, hold on, I have to talk about Leo. Leo is an angel that God sent to me. He was the very first bus driver I had. He drove from Philly to Pittsburgh. I'm so sad he's not the driver the entire way. He literally blessed me. He, I don't even know where to, where to begin with this man. So buses usually have a reserve section where you can pay extra and sit in reserved. He put me in reserve so that I can be sitting by myself and have space and the reserve seats are nicer. So he put me in the reserved area, first of all. And then he told me that if I need anything that I can call him or just text him or let him know and he'll call whoever is driving the bus and tell them to take care of me and make sure I'm safe. Like what? He's so sweet and he left me chocolates. I don't even know where he got chocolates. <laughs>
Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to St. Louis, Missouri. This is St. Louis, Missouri. Now, for your safety, please remain seated until the bus comes to a complete and safe stop. Okay, those passengers continuing on this bus westbound towards Rolla, Fort Leonardwood, Lebanon, Springfield, Joplin, Tulsa, Oklahoma City, Amarillo, Albuquerque, Phoenix, Flagstaff, Nevada, Las Vegas, Los Angeles, California. You're going to be here about 40 minutes. You're going to have about a 40 minute break. This bus is due out again at 730. Guys, we're in Joplin, Missouri, and it's finally an actual place to get food. I'm so happy. I can get some real food. Okay, let's see what they got. And we're on Route 66. Coach in Oklahoma. We're going to be switching our drivers. We're switching out the ticket. Guys, I'm in Oklahoma City and they're cleaning the bus. Alright, now we're going to get back on in like a half hour. It's really hot. It's like really hot. Really, 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 really hot and dry. So I can't wait to get back on the bus.
day, you guys. We're at a rest stop. For 20 minutes, he said. We've got 20 minutes. I'm gonna go in here. I'm not really hungry. It's too late for me to eat, but I'm still just gonna do it. Hot food. Oh my gosh, there's corn dogs. Ugh. People are gonna be like, why is she have a camera? Oh my gosh, I have a uh, waffle egg sandwich. That's waffle and egg. You know you're in the south. And corn dogs. This is like what people think of when they think of American food. Oh, I like these water bottles. Waiting so I can stretch my legs out a little bit more. I took a few pictures because this looks nice. I'm really, really... What's the word? I don't know. Let's go. <clears throat> Lethargic? Lethargic. Gallup, New Mexico, I believe. We have a 15 minute break, which is not very long. Yes, I do. Mm -hmm. This camera attracts a lot of attention. Anyways, I went in there and I got this t-shirt. I'll show you when I get on the bus. And this pin, since we're in Indian territory, there's like Indian merch everywhere.
Cause my heart is in the wrong 